Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to going to episode 8 of Wonderful Pretty Cares. Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. I'm honestly excited. It's my use first day, so here's hoping today goes well. You sound fine. We're only on episode eight, and the fact is she's like a few days ago, but like, girl. They'll hate you, babe. You'll do fine. Rest of bitch face, I can't. Oh, and it would rain on this day? Oh, my God. K Komogi? <laughs> yeah, this is a problem. You have to stay home. Because dogs aren't allowed at school and you can't speak to everybody. No, 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 not now. We can't have the meme of can the dog read and write. Literally Cody when I have to go to work. <laughs> School's pretty. Mm-hmm. 
Are, are you okay? Huh? Aw. <laughs> He's so cute. Oh my god. I'm scared how this is going to go. Your name? Oh, oh my god! What typically cats hate bath. No, oh my god, her sulky face is the resting bitch face, actually. No, it's okay! It's okay! See? Come okay. Well, baby, she probably doesn't come home until like three, maybe two, four, possibly. Come okay. Why do I feel like a police officer is going to, like, stop her and be like, shouldn't you be in school? Aw. Are you okay? Sure. Too many questions.
Girl, that's food. <laughs> you know, I didn't think dogs like fish. Because, you know, that's only cats. Come on, you don't have money. <laughs> it isn't bad that I just want to see a whole episode where she just runs around and just smells everything. Did she just change? Oh my god! Oh my god! A cat and a dog in a nutshell. I don't know where my home is. Good. Let me tell you, when she starts talking, boy, oh my god! She's just a popular person. But my you. It's a pig. Oh my god. Look at them. I just see them. Oh my god. Taking a nap. Oh my god. This is me when I want to be out work. When I'm at work and I really just want to go home and sleep. Look at the turtle. That's a big behind pig. That's the pig from that one show that I watched last season. Mm-hmm. <laughs> the kitty so pig. They know something's wrong. That's supposed to be a horse? Yuki's interested! Ah! <laughs> I 
<laughs> really, Kawagi? I'm glad you're in the shadows. I'm really to see, duh. Finally! Side by side! That's the only part you're gonna make of me, right? Right? I know you show. Yeah. Okay. I'm okay. But I, I will stay. Uh, I'll take that as a win until we get our other two. I thought I would never see the day. <laughs> Friendly. Once again, up in the running, the meme queen of this year. Penguin. Oh, the lion didn't think about that. Not the lion's fate. <laughs> yeah. My girl literally is just doing flash step up in here. <laughs> Come on. No, it's so cute. <laughs> I 
Every single freaking time she does this, it, it's just on you. We're like, yeah, come on. Let's go. Where are you? Oh, I miss my baby. I miss my family. So, where's my ear? Mm hmm. Can we just talk about how good the guy's uniform is? It's really pretty. Like, we always know the girls, girls' uniform, always. 10 out of 10. But the way the guys look, like, that is a really nice shade of brown. It suits them, I, I will say a lot. Because, like, sometimes, like, the boys' uniform in anime, it's always, like, a hit or a miss. Uh-oh. I think I'm going to like it here. Once again, can we just hurry up? And make these two pretty curious. I get once again, literally just having my two babies, my girl and her dog together. But I'm ready for my cat girl and her mayor owner to finally be in this group. Cause Satsuru, like he's already in it. Technically he's established, even though he's not, you know, a pretty cure just yet though. But you can do it, mm hmm. Because uh, I feel like you're they're gonna make us wait until April. Like I don't really know the the episode list for April. I, I haven't seen anything yet in like the last few weeks for you know pretty good news and such. But we know it's gonna happen soon. It's gotta happen like sometime between ten to at least twenty. At least before summer. We know that. But no, this was a really interesting episode. Now, with Mayu, I fell for her because of the fact is, like, yeah, you want that first impression. She still made a good impression regardless, even though she messed up. She's still a little, you know, introvert baby and who's trying to be, you know, this little cute little social butterfly, but still also be introverted. And, and that's okay. Everybody has their like moments and that's completely fine i think a lot of people are definitely going to relate to her 100 percent. i mean that's how like everybody felt with bochi like psh, every single week i was relating to bochi and like anything that i did because yeah i as much as i'm like a social butterfly online and in any of my videos i am like truly a big behind introvert and such. I am very much to myself, like, I don't really always want to talk to people and such. Like, I, there are some days where, like, okay, <laughs> for an example, today, or by the, probably by the time this comes out, tomorrow, but, um, today, of course, since this is still Saturday, uh, my mom wanted to go to the store. Um, even though she's still sick, and she wanted this certain type of, um, style of chicken at Publix and stuff, and I wanted a sandwich. So, instead of me, like, typically what I always do, instead of me calling on my phone, I literally just, every, every app, because our modern day technology, everything has an app. There's no reason for me to get on my phone, make a phone call, and literally talk to someone for, like, three to five minutes to make sure everything is correct. But... At the same time, it is still, like, 
with the modern technology, you still nine out of ten possibly need to call to make sure something is one hundred percent like making sure this is correct, that is correct, yada yada yada. Because for an example, today, um, I called the store, I called the deli, and I was like, "This is what I want. I want this sandwich like this, and then I want twenty pieces of chicken all flats. That's what she wanted." And I even had her repeat everything to me, and my mom overheard the conversation. So I, we go to the store, and my sandwich is already there, all waiting for me. And I'm like, all right, I'm ready to go. Let me grab all these extra little things that I want before I leave the store. Um, so we get her box of chicken that is supposedly supposed to be 20 pieces of flats, and half were flat and half were wings a drumstick and I'm looking like and I even said I was like I specifically told them flat I literally had a conversation with myself while I was on hold literally like making sure like this is what I want this is how I want it da -da 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 -da. this is my order regardless that's why it's kind of still important to call and stuff like yes as much as like I'm over here like mm -hmm, I can do this is like for an example like tomorrow probably after work I'm going to probably go to um, Kung Fu Tea to go get me some boba <laughs> to celebrate uh, Princess Peach Showtime and such. I'm gonna do everything on my phone because that's the quickest thing. I can do it while I'm on my way and then I ain't gotta walk in and say, hey, I wanna order X, Y, and Z, but I'm still gonna look to see X, Y, and Z if that's freaking correct and such. But, <laughs> yeah, moral of the story is always make sure you know when you do a phone call, make sure everything's correct, you know, especially when you get there. Because when it's not, you're pissed. That is the one time where, yes, the customer is right. Also, don't be a D. Be a nice person. Because, you know, there are days where customer, I mean, uh, workers have a bad day. Just as much as you. Regardless. Yes, yes. But, no, this was a really cute episode. Like I said, Mayu did a really good job on her first day. Um, the, once again, the chemistry of Iroha and Satoru, once again, is there, and I freaking love it. I'm here for it. His little yes <laughs> with the fact that they were going to be in the same class together was so freaking cute. Like, oh my god, the shippable moments. Give me a date episode with them or else. I'm just saying, but something tells me that's not going to happen, so even if it doesn't, I'm okay. Um... I don't really think I have anything else. No, I do. Okay, once again, the dynamic of Yuki and um, <laughs> Komogi, it is the best thing because of the fact is, like, their opposites attract and such. Um, Komogi is a very happy dog, and Yuki is, you know, independent kitty. And, and so, yes, it, <laughs> when, it, when it works, it works. When it doesn't, when it doesn't. So, <laughs> I know when we finally get to have Yuki as a pretty cure, I think it's just going to be even more hilarious between the dynamic of these two. But other than that, guys, that is my action view towards episode eight of Wonderful Pretty Cure. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. I join the Marshall Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially, y'all, next Saturday or Sunday. But probably Saturday since I don't have to go to work next Sunday. Since it'll be Easter Sunday and stuff and we'll be closed. Um, so either next Saturday uh, night before probably I go to bed for episode 9 or Sunday morning episode nine but until then i will see you guys all next time bye